Hey everybody, it's Deacon Chris. A few years ago, prior to COVID, a number of our parishioners went to Haiti to help to build a home there. And everyone I spoke to when they returned, they talked about how defining a moment that was in their faith. It was a moment where they experienced God in, in ways that were surprising to them, in ways that made the, the words of the gospel more meaningful in their life. And I was so touched by that, that reaching out to people who were in need in Haiti could really take the, the faith that we all love and, and put it into action. And a few months after that, a priest came for food for the poor. And he spoke about how you and I could actually change the lives of people in Haiti. My kids were really moved by that and they wanted to make a donation to Food for the Poor. And so you know, we took the envelope and we filled it out and they were able to send some of the money that they had earned from their allowance doing chores to Food for the Poor. And it's been something that they've really loved and have felt really connected to. You know, they're too young to travel to Haiti to do the good work uh, that others from our parish have done. But it was a really tangible way for them to participate and to share their faith in a meaningful way with those who are in need. You know, our kids, they can really catch us and, and teach us something about faith. So the question I guess they gave to me and, and my wife, and, and maybe to you as well, is, is there something that you can do? Is there something that I can do to help the people of Haiti who are so much in need? Over the last three months, Haiti has experienced a great deal of political turmoil, but also with the horrible earthquake that caused such devastation there. And then of course, with the hurricane season upon us, I invite you to take some time to, to pray and to think about the people of Haiti uh, and to ask if God is calling you in some way to help support them in their time of need. I hope everybody has a wonderful week. God bless you, and we'll see you real soon.